Have you ever wondered where we'd be without maths? It has an impact on almost everything we do, yet largely we take it for granted. Even in the TV world, on Countdown, the maths isn't just in the puzzles the contestants have to solve. The pictures from TV cameras are immediately converted into digits, millions of them every second. Those digits are chopped and changed, multiplied and divided as they go through the production process, travel down optical fibres and are transmitted through the ether, until they eventually reach your TV set where they're converted back into pictures and you see me! Not so very long ago, if you wanted to carry your favourite music albums with you, you'd have needed strong arms and a heavy box. Now you can carry them all in the palm of your hand. Inside every MP3 player some very clever math is implemented. When an album is recorded, the sounds are analysed automatically. Anything that is inaudible to the human ear is immediately thrown out, just like that. What's left is then broken down into patterns. If a pattern is repetitive, then you only need to keep one copy of it. The technique is called compression, literally because the digital data are being squeezed mathematically into a much smaller space. Maths is even being used to create new forms of entertainment. Computer games are blurring the boundaries between virtual and real worlds. When you throw a rubber ball against a hard surface, or drive a racing car around a sharp bend, or maybe zap an alien with a laser blaster, you want to know how the subject will react. All video games are basically sets of mathematical rules that control the behaviour of the characters and the objects in the game. So it's really all about triangles and vectors. Actually, if it's excitement you want, then you'll have to go a long way to beat a good roller coaster ride. There's nothing virtual about that. But you've guessed it, it's another place where mathematicians have been hard at work. Isaac Newton, who was as much of a mathematician as he was a physicist, came up with a set of equations governing the laws of motion. Using these equations, designers can predict exactly how their roller coaster trains will react. When you step on a roller coaster, it can feel like you've been through a crazy, out of control experience, but in reality, every twist and turn has been mathematically tested to produce maximum thrills with minimum risk. So, next time you sit back and relax, just think how much hard work and clever mathematics have gone into keeping you entertained.